We just saw a major political upset for many over the weekend. Incumbent Secretary of State Holly Sullivan lost the Republican nomination in her run for re-election. Instead, the party's delegates chose former Mike Pence aide Diego Morales. And Fox 59's Kristen Escal joining us now to explain what happened and also what this means for the race. Because it seems like a big rarity that you would have an incumbent yeah. not have the backing and support of their party. No, for sure. And this is getting a lot of attention already right after this happened. And Diego Morales' candidacy has many in the GOP excited, but opponents have raised questions about his past employment with the state. Meanwhile, Morales says he's focused on the future. Delegates at the Indiana GOP convention nominating Diego Morales for Secretary of State over incumbent Holly Sullivan. Political analysts consider this a sign of the divisions in the Republican Party and a rebuke of Governor Eric Holcomb and so-called establishment candidates. The party has been changing, certainly in the state of Indiana, over the last decade. And you, you've seen that division and the, the conflict between those who are more conservative and maybe a little bit less conservative. Diego Morales immigrated to the U.S from Guatemala when he was in high school and went on to serve in the National Guard before working in several state government roles. That includes his time as an aide to former Vice President Mike Pence while he was governor. The main reason for me running is simply to give back, uh, to contribute and to show my debt of gratitude. But opponents have raised concerns about Morales' employment record. State documents show in 2009 he was fired from his job at the Secretary of State's office where officials cited inefficient execution, lack of focus on strategy and planning, and lack of professionalism. Two years later, he resigned under a different Secretary of State after he was sent a performance improvement plan. Why should voters trust you to run that office now? You can ask all the delegates that I connected one-on-one -on -one with them. They saw my hard work. I'm the only candidate who has outworked everyone. Secretary Sullivan's campaign declined to comment for this story. Now, Morales will face Democrat Destiny Scott Wells and Libertarian Jeff Moore in the November election. We'll have more on the candidates and the issues in this race later this week. Kristen Escal, Fox 59 News. Kristen, thank you.